Fasting can be a challenging practice, but with the right mindset and preparation, it can be a transformative experience for both your body and mind. Let's explore the science behind this powerful practice. You might be surprised at the results. Keep watching to the end to discover everything you need to know about fasting and detox. Welcome to Medicatives, this is the official YouTube channel of www.medicatives.com. We believe that awareness is everything and our goal is to promote it. Fasting is the practice of abstaining from food and drink for a certain period of time. While it has been used for centuries in religious and cultural traditions, it has recently become a popular trend in the health and wellness community. Fasting can be done for a variety of reasons, including weight loss, improved blood sugar control, detoxification, and improved overall health. One of the primary benefits of fasting is weight loss. When you fast, your body uses stored fat for energy, which can lead to weight loss over time. Additionally, fasting can help reduce insulin resistance, which is a major risk factor for developing type 2 diabetes. Fasting has also been shown to have anti-inflammatory effects, which can be beneficial in preventing a variety of health problems. Fasting has also been associated with improved brain function. Studies have shown that fasting can increase the production of a protein called brain-derived neurotrophic factor, BDNF which is important for the growth and survival of brain cells. BDNF has been linked to improved mood, cognitive function, and memory. Additionally, fasting has been shown to increase the production of other proteins in the brain that are associated with improved learning and memory. Another potential benefit of fasting is detoxification. When you fast, your body goes into a state of autophagy, which is the process by which cells break down and recycle old or damaged proteins. This can help remove toxins from the body and improve overall cellular function. In fact, one study found that fasting can help protect against the harmful effects of exposure to toxins such as pesticides and heavy metals. Fasting has also been associated with improved longevity. While more research is needed to determine whether fasting has similar effects on humans, animals studies have found that animals subjected to intermittent fasting live longer than those with unrestricted access to food. This could be because fasting helps to reduce oxidative stress and inflammation, which are major contributors to the aging process. While fasting can have many potential benefits, it is important to approach it with caution. People with certain health conditions, such as diabetes or low blood pressure, should not fast without consulting a healthcare professional. Additionally, fasting can be difficult for some people, especially those who are used to eating frequently throughout the day. It is important to start slowly and gradually increase the length of your fasts over time. 1. Water fasting. 2. Intermittent fasting. 3. Time-restricted feeding. 4. Alternate day fasting. 5. Modified fasting. 6. Juice fasting. 7. Partial fasting. 1. Water fasting. Water fasting involves consuming only water and avoiding all other foods and drinks for a set period of time, typically for a few days to a week or longer. Water fasting is a challenging and intense form of fasting that requires careful planning and monitoring to avoid dehydration, electrolyte imbalances, and other potential health risks. Some people choose water fasting as a way to detoxify the body, lose weight, or promote spiritual or mental clarity. 2. Intermittent Fasting Intermittent fasting is a pattern of eating that involves alternating between periods of fasting and eating. There are several different approaches to intermittent fasting, but the most common method involves limiting food intake to a set time frame each day, typically between 8 to 10 hours. For example, a person may choose to eat all their meals between 11 a.m. and 7 p.m. and fast for the remaining 16 hours. Another popular approach to intermittent fasting is the 5 to 2 diet, which involves eating normally for 5 days of the week and restricting calories to 500 to 600 for 2 non-consecutive days. 3. Time-Restricted Feeding Time-restricted feeding is a form of intermittent fasting that involves limiting the time frame during which a person can eat each day. 
Typically, this involves eating all meals within an 8 to 10 hour window and fasting for the remaining 14 to 16 hours. This approach to fasting is often used to promote weight loss, improve metabolic health, and reduce inflammation. 4. Alternate Day Fasting Alternate day fasting is a type of intermittent fasting where a person alternates between periods of fasting and eating. On fasting days, a person consumes minimal calories or avoids food entirely, while on non-fasting days, they eat normally. Some people find this approach to be more sustainable than other forms of fasting because they can eat normally on some days, which may make it easier to stick to the fasting regimen. 5. Modified Fasting Modified fasting involves consuming a limited number of calories or specific types of foods during a fasting period. For example, a person may choose to consume only water and vegetable broth or limit their daily caloric intake to 500 to 600 calories during a fasting period. Modified fasting is often used as a way to ease into longer fasts or to minimize potential side effects of fasting. 6. Juice Fasting Juice fasting involves consuming only fresh fruit and vegetable juices for a set period of time. This type of fasting is often used to detoxify the body, improve digestive health, and promote weight loss. It is important to note that juice fasting can be high in sugar and low in protein, which can lead to energy crashes and nutrient deficiencies. 7. Partial Fasting Partial fasting involves abstaining from certain types of foods or drinks, such as meat, alcohol, or caffeine, for a set period of time. This type of fasting can be easier to sustain than other forms of fasting because it allows a person to eat regular meals while still reaping some of the benefits of fasting. For example, some people may choose to avoid meat for a week or two as a way to detoxify the body and improve digestion. In conclusion, fasting can have many potential benefits, including weight loss, improved blood sugar control, reduced inflammation, improved brain function, detoxification, and longevity. However, it is important to approach fasting with caution and to speak with a healthcare professional before beginning a fasting regimen. Additionally, it is important to listen to your body and stop fasting if you experience any negative side effects. We would love to hear your thoughts on this video, so let us know in the comments what you liked or didn't like, and any ideas for future videos. Thanks for watching. Please visit our website www.medicatives.com. You may like our free ebooks and medical and health educational products on our website. If you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing, sharing, liking, commenting, and pressing the bell icon to receive notifications for more content like this. Lastly don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter.